Hi, this is Gary with MacMost.com. In this episode I'm going to show you how to use Memoji stickers including a way that few people know about to send your own custom Memoji stickers. A big thanks to everybody that supports MacMost through its Patreon campaign. Go to MacMost.com slash Patreon. There you could read more about it join us and get exclusive content. So if you want to tell somebody how you feel you could tell them face to face or call them on the phone. But we all know the best way to do that is through a text message. Now for a long time we've been able to use emoji to convey emotions in our messages. So we can attach a little character to let people know if we're happy, sad, angry, surprised, horny, or whatever. But with the new feature in iOS 13 called Memoji Stickers you could take the Memoji, the little characters you can create that kind of look like you, and you could have these little emotions conveyed using these characters. There is a predefined set of 24 that you can use with either a Memoji that you've created or one of the existing Animoji characters that Apple has had around for a while. But using a little hidden trick you can also create your own Memoji or Animoji stickers as well. So there are all sorts of different things that you could send in a message using the Messages app in iOS 13 on your iPhone or iPad OS on your iPad. For instance you can tap on the Emoji button on the keyboard and then you can add one of the standard Emoji. People do this all the time. But you can also send unique things using Memoji and Animoji. Memoji are the little characters that you can build to look like yourself and Animoji are the built in ones that Apple's included. So let's take a look at using those. Tap the App button to the left of the message field if you don't already see the list of apps there below the message field. Now there are two that deal with Memoji and Animoji. The first one we're going to look at is the stickers functionality. That's the third one over here on my screen. You can arrange yours in any way you want by editing the apps that you use. I'm going to tap that and at the top I'm going to see a list first of the Memoji that I've created and then of the Animoji. These are the ones that Apple includes. You know, a little alien there and the panda and all the different things. These have been around for a little while now. And then with the Memoji you can tap the three dots there and edit the ones that you've got or, or create a new one if you want. So you can add a bunch of different Memoji there. Now whichever one is selected is going to generate 24 different stickers below. These are basically little emoji generated using your Memoji or the selected Animoji there. If you want to insert one in a text message just select it and then it puts it in to the message as an image. This is important because as an image it means it can go to basically anybody on any phone. They could have an Android phone so they don't have the Memoji or Animoji functionality but since this is just a regular image they get to see it anyway. And then you could send it to them. So you could switch to Using different ones you can create Memojis that maybe are specifically for this of characters or anything that you want. And you could also go and use all of the weird Animoji that Apple has. So you have tons of options that are different than just including a standard Emoji character. But what if you don't want to use one of the 24 stickers here? It would be nice to be able to create your own like a surprise look or a puzzled look or a sly look. So you think you'd be able to do that here. But you can't do it here but you can do it somewhere else. For that let's go over to the older Animoji app. It's got the little Animoji of the monkey there as its symbol. And this is primarily used for making little video clips with your Memoji or Animoji. So you can pick what character you want. You know, Use one of Apple's. Use your own Memoji. And then record and you can record a short little clip. It's going to take the audio from you and it's going to take the expressions from your face and then create a little video clip with your Memoji. That sounds great. And now I can send that and it's going to create this little looping animation of me saying that over and over again. But what if I just want to do a sticker? I don't want to actually have a video of that. I want to have something that's just an image just like those stickers that we were looking at before. You can do that as well. You can do it right here. It's really easy but you have to know the trick. What you need to do is make your expression and then once you've got it perfect just double tap on the image. Watch. So I made the expression. I double tapped right on my face there on the screen and it took an image from that and now I can send that as a sticker. 
So not only do you have the 24 stickers that you could use with your Memoji, you can create more Memoji if you want. Use Apple's Animoji. But you can also go into the Animoji app here, create any expression you want, and double tap to create a sticker. So now you basically have an infinite number of options of different custom stickers that you can create using Memoji or Animoji. I publish new tutorials every weekday. Hit the subscribe button so you don't miss out. Then hit the little bell icon to get notifications for each new tutorial.